Hi guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make a yogurt parfait. I really like this recipe because it's easy, it's fun, and there are so many different options you can use with ingredients that you have at home. So, I will show you the list of ingredients. So you do need some type of yogurt, I'll be using Greek yogurt. Then you need some type of crunchy ingredient, so like granola, cereal, or graham crackers. Your favorite type of berry, or berries and honey if you have it, but that's also optional. So I'll go through and show you what I'll be using today. So for the yogurt, I just have plain Greek yogurt, but if you would rather have um, a flavor, you can get some type of flavored yogurt at the grocery store. I do recommend getting some type of Greek yogurt though, because it has a lot less sugar than other types of yogurt. For the crunchy ingredient, I'll be using vanilla crunch granola, but any type works. If you don't have granola, you can also use crushed up graham cracker. And if you don't have either of those, you could also use cereal. So like Frosted Flakes, Honey Nut Cheerios, or Plain Cheerios, whatever you like best. For the berries, my favorite are blueberries, so I'll be using those, and strawberries. So I already cut up my strawberries. I think it was about four strawberries or so. So if you want to use strawberries, I would recommend using three to four of those. So what you're going to do is take some type of clear glass container or plastic. So I have a few different options. So like just a plain glass like this, one like this. I also already made a yogurt parfait, but while I was filming, I messed up. So this is my finished one. So any type of clear container works. So what you're going to do is take your container and start with the yogurt. So. You're going to take one big scoop of yogurt and fill the bottom. So one scoop in and flatten it just like that. Then you're going to take whatever type of berry you want to use. So I'm using strawberries and blueberries. So take a couple handfuls of the berries. So I have my strawberries. Now the blueberries. Then you're going to take whatever kind of crunchy ingredient you want to use. So I'll be using the granola. And just take a few handfuls and put it on top of the berries. Just like that. Then you're going to do the same thing over again. So take your yogurt again, do one big handful, not handful, spoonful, <laughs> put it on top and flatten it out. Might look a little messy, but it will still taste good. It's okay. Then you're gonna take your berries again. So the strawberries, blueberries, and layer that on top. This would also be really good with blackberries or raspberries, but I didn't have those today. So I'm just using these two. Then you're gonna take your crunchy ingredient. So granola, put it on top. and you have your yogurt parfait. So if you wanted, you could keep going and do another layer of yogurt berries in your crunchy ingredient, but I'll stop there. If you do have honey, I recommend just drizzling a little bit on top. So just like a teaspoon or so. Adds a little bit of a sweet flavor. So here is your yogurt parfait. So this is super easy, it's fun, and there are so many different options that you can use with stuff that you have at home. So give this a try and let me know what you think.